convicted of killing three people in a car accident in 2009 back in court. A judge will hear from his attorney who's trying to set him free. Two works for your reporter Gitzel Puente is live from the courthouse with the newest details. Good morning, Gitzel. Good morning, Max. I just spoke to defense attorney Clark Brewster. He says he's seeking justice for his client today, and I also reached out to the DA, but I have not received any comment yet. Now, the 24 year old was convicted to 24 years in prison, another 24 years in probation. That's a total of 48 year sentence. So far, he has served four years behind bars. Now, last October, he was let out on bond, but his freedom only lasted one week. The DA filed for an appeal and he was sent back to prison. Then in November, the first post-conviction hearing was held where Jameson's attorney argued Jameson's uh, innocence. Now, he was charged for driving with a suspended license, but his attorney says that his license was not canceled properly. Jameson crashed into a car carrying a family of three in 2009. It happened on Christmas Eve near Sand Springs. The victim's family is still grieving and is seeking justice. The family wants Jameson to serve his full sentence in prison, but Jameson's attorney Clark Brewster says that he deserves to get out because it was just an accident. Everybody ought to be in unison saying this can happen in Oklahoma, it can happen in the United States. For example, there were mm -hmm. 71,000 accidents in 2009 in the state of Oklahoma, 700 fatality accidents, and truly they are accidents. The hearing is scheduled for 1.30 this afternoon. We will be following this criminal case. Reporting from the courthouse, Jitsel Puente Torx for you.